Hello, Foundation Life. Hope you're enjoying this great week in the Lord. What a beautiful day it is today. I'm praying for you, praying that you're walking closely with the Lord, praying that you're applying His Word and obeying His Word, and praying that you're having those opportunities to make touches, to share the truth that God has revealed to you. Well, last week we had the privilege to look at the passage in Mark chapter 4, where Jesus and his disciples went through a storm. And remember, our two points of emphasis was, the first one being that the storms of life have an eternal purpose. And what a privilege that is to know that because of God's mercy, the storms in our life have an eternal purpose. So I think the first thing we need to do is ask a question. And that question is, is there something that God's teaching me? Something that's going on in my heart? Is there an area in my life where I'm not obeying him, something he's asking me to do that I'm dragging my feet on. And I think first we start there. And remember the storms of our life are not only for us, but sometimes they're for those around us. But I think God would always say start with self-examination. And then the second point of emphasis that we touched on is this. Having the right view of God helps us overcome our fear. Remember in our passage that the disciples forgot about their circumstances when they saw who Jesus truly was. And what a reminder for us that when we fix our eyes on Jesus, or the song that we talked about on Sunday, turn your eyes on Jesus. When we turn our eyes on Jesus and we see his character, we see who our God is, then our circumstances become small. They go to the background. And they go to the background because we see how great our God is. We see how big our God is. We see how worthy our God is of worship. I know many of us are going through storms right now. We've just gone through storms. But I hope that those truths, you're able to hide them in your heart because it's so important to understand that under God's mercy, He's teaching us in the storm. And that when we have the right view of Him, when we see Him as He truly is, even though our circumstances don't change, we walk in joy and peace that comes from knowing our God. A couple things to remember this week. This Sunday we celebrate Father's Day. Hope to see all of you there. And remember, next Thursday at 6 p.m., I believe it's June 21st, we have a golf outing at Valley Vista. And so, guys, I hope that you can make that. There's several of us I know that are signed up, but we would love to have anybody join us. So keep that in mind. Hope you have a great week in the Lord, and we'll see you Sunday.